sorry for the intermission, but my husband called me. But back to business as usual. I have to wash dishes. Then I make some Kool-Aid real quick because we ain't got nothing but water in here. Gotta get some juice Friday. Chicken already been about unthawed when he called me and asked me what I was cooking. And you know, usually I try to cook what he likes, but I gotta be at work early in the morning, so I'm trying to get all this stuff done now. Cause by the time my eggs are coming, I'm trying to be in the bed. I have to be to work at four. That means I need to get up at three. So. And I mean, that's it for the rest of the work, but at least I get to, you know, get off early on Friday. I'm going to try to, uh, try to take this trash out. I'm going to try to get off early, because I need to get some, I need to get a couple things for my mama. From the store, and I need to go pick up the kids on Friday, too, so. That's bad. But anyway, I'm about to do some chicken and uh, make some okras and tomatoes and rice. I wish I had sucker tags to come with the lima beans in it, but I don't have none. But these are the okras and tomatoes and corn that I get from the Dollar Tree. I'm gonna put a little bacon in it too. And another little trick is you can add tomato ketchup to your meals to make it a more tomato-y. And I am going to add some garlic powder, onion powder, black pepper, and some Italian seasoning. So I'm going to do that. First, I'm going to get this bacon in the pan. So that's that. Turn off the pan real quick. That's that. And I'm going to go ahead and open up the okra and tomatoes. My chicken should be thawed out in a minute because it was damn near thawed out before I put it in the uh in the thing. But right now I'ma just open these. I'm gonna rinse these cans off real quick. I don't have to cook no rice because we already got some from the other day, so I'ma just put a tad bit of water in it and let it get let it warm up. Put that on low with the top on. I'm gonna use, I'm gonna cook with some of this beef flavored broth. And where's that other gourmet season that I had? There you go. So I'm going to use some powdered chicken flavored bouillon. It's about time for this bacon to cook up too. Use one of these. Matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and put that in the, in the pot. 
And that's what it looked like. This is the thing, just in case y'all want to go to Walmart and pick you up some. And I'm going to look to see if I got a pack of the um, frozen celery and onions. Look to see if I got a pack of that. And I'll put that in my, um, in my chicken too. I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and add and pull this grease into a bowl. And just add my okra and tomatoes and let all of that, the rest of the grease, kind of flavor the okra and tomatoes. I ain't pouring all of it out, just the majority of it. Alright, so it's still a little bit of grease left in that pan. Now I'm going to turn it down real low. Turn it down real low. Can't really see with that thing with this pot in the way, but I turned it down on low. And I'm adding my okra and tomatoes and corn. I might need one more can. I don't think this is enough. So we gotta eat for a couple of days off this. At least today and tomorrow. Put this broth in here. Hold on, my husband calling. So this is the um the pot that has my um chicken bouillon and my beef broth and my celery and my onions. So now I'm finna just add my chicken. Broth is gonna add more flavor to the chicken. Let's just see what I'm doing. That's what it's looking like so far. So I'm gonna add a little bit of water just to cover the top of the chicken. And just using one of these bread cups. I use almost the whole cup, not the whole entire cup, because I do want to keep the flavor. And just stir that just a little bit, just to get everything down in the pot. Sorry. This is just to get everything down in the pot. And Rico kind of like his gravy thick, but I like thin gravy. I like broth over my rice. But, um, yep. We're going to let this cook down. Put the top over it. And put the top over it. Put the top over these ultras and tomatoes. Oh. What what part I'm a, what top I'm gonna use? <laughs> I guess I'll use a um a plate. Sorry for the noise. Use a plate and just do it like that. All right. So that's on low. I'm actually. Turn the chicken up just a little bit just to get it boiling. <clears throat> and uh, so the chicken is on high, the okra and the rice is on low, which I probably need to. Nah, because it still got to cook and whatnot.
All right, so I'm going to get cleaned up and I'm going to eat a little bit and I'm going to come back whenever um this gets to boiling. And then, you know, I'll take it from there. Okay, guys. So this is dinner all done. I've already tasted my chicken. It is so good. I love stewed chicken. But that's what your food should look like when you finish. Woo!